Yo, I'm Nez. I'm about to drop some more car tech on you. And this time, what we're going to be doing a review of is the BAM. This is the iCOS magnetic, oh, magnetic, magnetic cup mount holder for your smartphone. And uh, this is pretty much, you know, some artwork as to what it looks like. Uh, self explanatory. It goes, it sits in one of your cup holders in your car or your truck like so and um if you have the magnetic back on the back of your smartphone this will hold that now they do have them where they have the clamps but um um so that way it'll hold your phone that way but i happen to have magnetic backs on the um cases of uh my uh, smartphone uh, and tablet and stuff so this works perfect for me so uh without further ado let's just get right into this uh this is the front of the box bong side of the box has got the little some more iCross logo branding there. Top, same thing, iCross branding. Other side, same as the first. Bottom, nothing. And then the back, got a little bit of information. You can pause that, read it for yourself. Bong. And then some more artwork. And then your, you know, barcode and stuff and like everything else made in China. So. Uh, without further ado, let's get into this. Let me uh, get this box open. Hold on a second, let me pause it. Okay, let's get up into this bad boy, see what we're working with. Okay, let's set this box over to the side here. <clears throat> Got a little bit of literature here. But y'all already know how I feel about that. I'll just let y'all up. Oh, I ripped it, so pretty much useless any damn way. Well, you, you get it. It comes with it. And then you get the device here that's in sealed plastic. So let me uh, rip this open, and uh, we'll come right back in. Okay, so the device is all one piece. <clears throat> As you see, this is the... Oh, wow, this is a pretty strong mount there doesn't got a lot of give in it so this definitely can hold let's say like a tablet or whatever you know this this would be great for that um so over here you got the back part that plugs into the back and then you plug into your cigarette lighter to provide the power and also you have so you're not losing the cigarette lighter you can also plug any existing into here if that's what you uh want to do and then here is the unit. You're provided with two USB ports right there. And then you got two more car adapter receptacles there. And um, and then the bottom, you could twist it to adjust to, to the width of any um, cup holder. I think, can go, I think they say it goes up to 3.75 inches. And, um, and there was supposed to be something on top. To, for the magnet let me see if I can find that hold on and here goes the magnet portion also wrapped up in plastic check that out and that's what she looks like so that clips on to the back of this and then you have your your magnet surface and it already comes with one stuck to it that's pretty strong grab so I already I can save this one for another device because as I already have a magnet on the back of my phone so what I'm going to do is <clears throat> stick that there for now and just put this on make sure this goes on right maybe it goes on this way Imagine that's probably the way that it goes. Hmm. I'm gonna pull that to let it come out. Do I put it in this way, maybe? Okay, so that bad boy is on there. I'm gonna move this piece out the way for now. And we're gonna switch sides. Put this over here on this side, just for the time being. Put this over here. And what I'm gonna do, and I'll move this out the way altogether. 
And what I'm going to do now is I'm going to test out my tablet with it. Okay, as you know, right now I got my tablet on that big magnet, so now I'm going to stick it on this magnet and see how well she holds. And as you see, it's hold my tablet, tablet there, lovely. And that's a eight inch tablet right there. So if that'll hold my tablet well, then holding my cell phone will be no issue whatsoever. So that's that's pretty damn good. Let me turn it around so you can see it from the back. We'll put the tablet on the other side. Bong. As you see, it's holding it pretty well. Um, you see I got the big magnet stuck to the back of my uh, case there. That's how you know I generally do it. I don't I never stick the magnets directly to any of the devices. I always stick by a case and stick it to the case. So because you know I always sell my devices after I get tired of them or they run its uh, term where I upgrade or whatever. Y'all know how I do. But uh, yeah, man, this um this works good. So let's uh, plug it in, get some power to it, and uh, get some stuff plugged into it and see how we're working. So um see you on the flip. Real quick before we hook some power up to it, let's adjust it. In order to adjust it. All you do is spin the ring. You turn the ring around to adjust the size there. It's kind of hard for me to do it and hold the camera. But you pretty much, this little ring right here, um, I'm focusing on it. You turn that ring and then it adjusts and these little clamps around here start coming out to adjust to the size of whatever cup. And then that's how you make it tight. So I'm going to go ahead and adjust it, make it tight in the cup. And then we're going to hook the power up to it. So I'll check you when I come back. Okay, we back in. I transferred a couple of things. So now you can see that they actually have power to it. There's my, uh, um, it, it reads my battery voltage, but it's also a power receptacle for my multi multiple port power thing down there. It's got to redo some of the wires. I just did this really quick just to show you guys. Uh, there goes my, um, my Escort uh, Redline uh, uh power adapter there with the uh, button the mute button on it which I love the fact that now my mute button is right there so I don't have to reach up to the dashboard and press the mute button like I've been doing now you know I could just press you know press down there that makes it so much simpler um, yeah man got my USB ports my USB port right there that's for the that's for this right here my USB C for the phone that I'm recording this on and then the other USB port see how it's going off up there See, now I could just press the mute button back here. Bomb. Muted. See? I love that. Um, the other USB port is plugged into the back of the, you know, the um, the red line radar detector port because they had an extra port there. And that's what's powering my tablet right now. So, yeah, man. Everything's perfect. And I still have another USB receptacle for something else. Who knows? Maybe I might go crazy one day. I don't know. There's USB ports for everybody. So, yeah, man. This thing is awesome. And you see, this thing is holding the tablet, no effort. No effort, like T Grizzly, no effort. So, I have to honestly say that, yeah, this was this was only $10. Like, seriously, fellas, $10, and you get all this. You literally get all this. So, um, I'm going to say, yeah, definitely cop that. So, with that being said, I'm Nez. This has been another Car Tech review on the iCross Magnet Cup Mount Holder um, for your cell phone, as well as powering other devices. I'll put the links in the description where you can find that. I'm Nez, cop that, and I'm out this piece.